Hi, this is Dan McNulty of Open Music Labs, continuing my walkthrough of the programs uh, in the micro deck. Uh, it's our reprogrammable effects unit. Uh, I'm on to the pitch shifters. The first one is the up-down sweep, which plays through uh, samples and memory forwards and backwards. At different rates, so it uh, kind of it ups an octave what you're playing, as well as creating a rhythm based on the delay time, which is uh, kind of dialable through this mod one. It's a stereo effect. And things are really interesting as you start to turn up the feedback. Here's the feedback up, up around 10 o'clock. Let's try a lower rate. The mix is all the way up right now, but if we get some of the dry in... You can kind of play in the middle of the effect. Alright, but the next one is our uh, chromatic pitch shifter. I'm going to turn the mix all the way up so you get just the effect. We can dial up the pitch in intervals of half step on the rotary encoder. Show you without the feedback. dial in some of the dry again so you can start to hear the difference. I like to use this as kind of a chorus. You can get things that are kind of in tune or out of tune. So here I'll just dial it all the way up. It stops at an octave above where you're going to play. feedback up a little. You can start to hear things climbing as they get uh, pitch shifted with each repeat. Go down below an octave too. Just give the uh, totally wet. adjust the delay so that it's nearly real time. You want to get just above the modulation pitch. some of the wet again. The next one is a sampler. So right now I had a little bit left in memory. We decided to leave the uh, sampler taking in whatever it's got in memory. And you can change the pitch of it with 
the mod knob. But the main use of this is you can uh, dial in any of any uh, sample that you want. You can just hit the mod two button, and then it records whatever it's got, and it plays it back at a rate determined by mod one. It even interpolates between the samples, so essentially it's synthesizing when you turn the audio lower. You can create some really interesting effects with this. Anyway, that concludes the, uh, the pitch.